Hey everyone, welcome to another lecture. Now here we are going to learn how to delete the account of the user. So let's say we want to give an option to delete the uh, user account permanently here, then we can also do that. And Firebase provide a method for that as well. So what we're going to do is we're going to add one more option here to delete account. And if, if user click on that, we will display the pop up saying, are you sure? And if they click on yes, then we will go ahead and delete the account and log out the user. Okay, so let's go ahead and do that. Now here in the option menu, I'm going to go and add one more items and that is for delete account. Okay. Or we can also say close account. It's up to you. So delete account menu is the ID that I want to give obviously. And now let's go to the main activity and add one more uh, if else condition. So just after this if item dot get item id is equals to the one that we are looking for that is delete account menu in that case we will uh, display the pop-up to the user so we already have this alert dialog right so we can use the same alert dialog uh, instance of alert dialog dot builder to create new alert dialog so here so reset alert dot set title set masses now let's go ahead and set negative and positive button so set positive button that is for ok and we will set the new dialog interface for on click listener and in another case set negative button where we will let the user cancel the operation okay now we'll go ahead and create the dialog and show to the user so if user click on okay that means user wants to delete his account right so in that case we will just call the firebase user user and we'll use auth that is firebase instance that we already have here here right this is firebase auth that is that is instance of firebase authentication class so we can use that and get currently logged in user and after that we can call user dot delete okay so it will just delete that particular user's account and we will add add on success listener and if the user account is deleted successfully then we will log out the user and display the message account deleted and we will send the user we will log out the user so let me call auth sign out and we will send the user to the login activity so intent and login.class and we'll finish the activity so let's go ahead and see this in action so let's open this in emulator now we do have this delete account option here so click on it it says are you sure and if i click on ok let me go here and make sure that we do have this uh, user here right so let me refresh this we do have two user here so i'm going to delete this one so let's come here and click on OK. OK, so nothing is happening right now. So let's see what is the problem. So let me add on failure listener as well. Just to debug what is going on here. OK, so let me toast the error message that we get. OK, let's run this again. So click on delete account click on ok and it says that we need to re-authenticate so what happening here is actually i opened this app i logged in into this application yesterday uh, i'm now i'm making this lecture in another day so it is asking me to re-authenticate okay just to make sure that i'm the um, you know original user or i'm the real user that is using this account so that's why it is asking for re-authenticate so, so let's log out and log in again 
okay that is the most easier way to do it so okay let's log, log in again and now let's go here and delete account and click on okay and it should work it says account deleted now we are at the login screen so let's go here and refresh this and see yes now we don't have that users okay so that user is permanently deleted from our system so he won't be able to log in again okay guys so that that's how we delete the user and this is it for this email authentication part now we'll go ahead and start another section where we'll talk about firebase otp authentication using phone number how we can create the account log in the user and do a whole lot of other operations so i'll see you there